Okay. A new game. Ladder, ladder game number three has been set up. It is between Mithunian and Casey's Craig, who are not ranked with a rating of 1,222 versus Danium <laughs> Warlighter and General Arun Warlighter ranked 28th with a rating of 1187. Yeah, we have a rating now because we've completed one game so far. <laughs> yep. So All right. Start off by looking at their profiles. And we can also... I can nudge you. Just I can nudge you if you want to be nudged. I can nudge you too. But anyways, Danian Warlighter is apparently Warlighter's second in command, which is a clan or something group. Innocence proves nothing. <laughs> he has played 427 total ranked games, won 142 of them. No, it's 492 multiplayer games. You read I, it from I, the I wrong ranked. spot. Oh, ranked. ranked. Okay, all right, fine. Maybe you did say it from the right spot. <laughs> uh, he has a 31% 1v1 win rate, 31% 2v2 win rate, 40% 3v3 win rate. Overall, 25%. Well, no, 30% or something like that. Something around there. It doesn't matter. About 30%. Something like that. Okay, um... Going he hasn't to the other person. often, which is nice. General Arun, part of the Warlighter Juggernaut Confederation, apparently the leader of the Clan of Warlighters. If you want to join, just ask. Um, Here, oh. here's some advertisement for you. Yay. Best rank ever in 1v1 ladder is 90th. He's currently ranked 102nd. Uh, his best 2v2 rank is 27th, which is with the other opponent that we have. Uh, he's played uh, 1,004 no, 20... Oh, games. okay. Got it. He's won 220 of them. That's like a 22% win rate. Yeah, that, that that's pretty exact. That divides pretty <laughs> No, but not pretty. No, whatever. Okay, 1v1, 23% win rate. 2v2, 33% win rate. 3v3, 27% win rate. He's played a lot of different FFA games, apparently. Oh, yeah, you can see a bunch of them there. But that happens with anybody that has a whole yep. ton of games. Anything over a 1,000, I consider a whole ton. Okay, well, we can now join the game. Oh, my God. Joining. And I can no longer nudge you. <laughs> okay, we have Wastelands in Ontario, Sipple, Egypt, Western Siberia. Oh, and uh, Great Plains. Yeah, that's that true. Well, um, we know North America is not very viable. And that one in Egypt is really crucial. Yeah, that's that's pretty cool there. Wow, that's funny. Movement between Africa and Asia is going to be very, very, very difficult. Very, um, very. Hmm. Hmm. And well, Sipple gets rid of... I guess Sipple no Arctica. one's going in Scott, huh? No one's starting in Scott? Are we, are we sure <laughs> on that? I don't know. Unless they wanted to go for uh, Australia. Well, yeah, I guess so. Meh. <laughs> yeah, they could do that, but still, meh. They could All get right. Australia in two turns. We could get Southeast Asia in one turn. <laughs> or Scandinavia in one turn. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Hmm. <sighs> Oh. Yawn. So, where do you want to go? I'm thinking. I'm not sure. I'm thinking. Where? I'm thinking one of us should start in Southeast Asia again, and one of us should start in Scandinavia. But that's so generic. <laughs> Matthew doesn't like being normal. <laughs> He's never liked being normal. Uh, let's see. Mm. God, it's like uh, parts of Africa, South America, Central America, and East U.S. are just so isolated in this, with this. Mm hmm. Because you can't true. go through Antarctica to get to South America. You can't go through Egypt to get to Africa. So it's like that whole area is pretty much cut off. Mm hmm. That is an interesting dynamic. Hmm. Okay, that does mean that if one person does spawn down there, 
they're pretty much isolated from everything and won't really be involved unless the other person gifts them something. Mm. At least not involved very quickly. Well, yeah, but that's a really good starting position if you think about it. Yeah. To grow. But if the Being other person... isolated is, not, like, is really good for a player. Yeah. However, let's say that the other person starts in Asia and then both of us start in Asia and then we gang up on him and kill him in the first four then, you know, being isolated is not so good. Yeah, but that, yeah. yeah didn't I don't really know. happen. Hmm. It won't happen unless <laughs> he starts, like, in Caucasus and Archangelsk. <laughs> hmm. Yeah. Then we would stab him in the face and kill him. And eat his bones. But, uh, uh let's see. I was, I initially placed my first and second spots in Norway and Ukraine. And I'm thinking my third might be in Venezuela. I don't know. <laughs> because I like that isolation. <laughs> that isolation makes me a happy camper. A happy camper, indeed. Hmm. Okay, then. Actually, Cuba would probably be the best then. Or maybe not. I'm not sure. Cuba... Venezuela, three and four. I think, yeah, I think Cuba might be better than Venezuela. Because it lets you go to uh, Hawaii easier, which can be used to get to Indonesia and Japan. I like how Texas is more fortified in this. In the <laughs> other, in that other game against Rubina, an unknown soldier, that guy, he took Texas on me and going after me. And, uh, and he broke my bonus because they could take Texas. Darn evil Texans. <laughs> uh. Letting my opponents through. Okay, well, I'm not sure. Hmm. Do I want to go Southeast Asia or not? I think you should. Yeah, but I always do that. <laughs> no, I've done it. And I always lose. <laughs> And I always lose. But the thing is, what's nice about it is there are no close starting positions to you that could touch you in one turn. Except for Kazakh, of course. But I don't I don't yeah. see why anyone would want to start in that piece of crap. Mm. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, unless you started in Ukraine and Tomsk. I mean, Kazakh seems like a what the kind of spot. It just It's terrible. Look at that. Okay, then I will go Malaysia first. And India there's Mongolia, second. I guess, could touch you in Pakistan, but that's no big huh. deal. You could defend that, I think. It would be a little difficult, but it could be done. Ooh, and then maybe third in Taiwan. Oh! And then you could kill whoever was there. Well, let's say I get Malaysia, someone else gets India, and I get Taiwan. Then first move, I take Thailand, and then the Philippines and Borneo... Second move, I put pretty much everything in Thailand because I've got enough to capture Papua New Guinea. But you have enough to take... Pa yeah, yeah, that's... <laughs> you said exactly the words I was thinking, but I didn't know the name of the location, so I was, like, trying to oh. correct you, even though you already got it right. <laughs> that's great. Uh, perfect. I love that strategy. Take and Papua New maybe Guinea. Congo will be number four. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. The Congo. Uh. And then I guess Molly, number five. Yeah, I could make my number five something like uh, Archangel. Or I could just, I could go like one, two, three to uh, to Norway, Ukraine, and Arch Archangel. <laughs> I could try that. I don't know if I want to. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. I could put Venezuela below that for some reason. I could do it. Mm, yeah, Archangel Scare. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I could make that my last choice. Or not. Because I could try to go for Tomsk and see if I could get that. If I have these bad choices, like everybody gets all of my spots, then I could. <laughs> yeah. And that won't happen. I'll get something better. But uh, I've got those six starting spots, even though I won't yep. need them. 
Committing. Committing indeed. Okay, game has started. Yes, and we got the locations we wanted. Perfect. We both got our first two locations, so we have very little idea of where they are. Yes, that that makes me very curious. I will want to look over here. They all we know is that they're not near Scandinavia, not near uh, India, and not probably, hopefully, not where the uh, wastelands are. So that's probably <laughs> well, not Canada. West actually, US. I'd hope they are in those yeah. wasteland locations. <laughs> well, give them a terrible for their start. Sake. Yeah, for their Whatever. sake. For their sake, I hope they well, are. I think because of Egypt, we can assume that probably one of them is either in Africa or like South America slash Central America. Yeah, I'd say they probably. Oh man, I just hope one of them isn't in Tajikistan or Archangelsk. <laughs> Or, uh, Those are the worst. Mongolia East, would also East be China. bad. Or well, no, no, East, East China, China you can have, you'll have plenty of time to, yeah. you'll be able to take Hong Kong before he gets there, so you'll be fine. Uh, in fact, that's what I think. If you don't see anybody in Tad, in Tad or uh, anybody go to Xinjiang, which you'll know, of course, then you should worry about Hong Kong the most. Yeah. Of course. Uh, me, I'm going to be worrying about the guy from Archangelsk. Oh, man. <laughs> if anybody's over there, then this won't be the best start like we wanted it to be. All right, so anyway, doing our moves. Okay, well, I'm committed. I'm just doing simple oh, already. attacks. It's obviously easy first move. Hmm... Let's I see. wonder where the other guy would start. Boop. Boop. I want that to be the first move so they can't tell whether or not I take it. Yeah. If there is a guy and he makes his first move from Archangelsk to Murmansk, then he won't be able to see. Hopefully, he'll, there's a smaller chance that he'll see my attack in Svalbard. Mm. So anyway... And that will be my third attack. I could make it... Well, no, that's better. Uh, hmm. So that's it. Hopefully this works well. Uh, yep. Did you do your stuff all right? Yep. All right. Committing. Crossing fingers. <laughs> all right. Watching turn. Watching turn. Yes. Yes. I got Svalbard. Yes. Yeah, I got my three. Yes, you got Thailand. Perfect. <laughs> this is a good start. So far, no one has attacked Pakistan, so probably no one in Tajikistan. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hopes. Hopes. Hopes are made to be dashed, Matthew. Oh, in Tajikistan. oh, well, that's actually not so bad because he attacked the wrong spot. He is not. Yes, yes, he is not in position to do damage to you. Perfect. It's possible his other location was an Archangel's can you move to Ufa. Oh, that is... Ooh, we're gonna... This guy is in trouble, man. If that's what he did, he is in deep, deep trouble. Man, because we are gonna kill him right at the start, if that's what they did. Oh, man. Uh, So if he's in Ufa... Oh man, this is gonna be so good. Okay, I'm gonna be hitting him with eight on my third move. Other than that, I'm taking Hong Kong. All right. Hmm. All right. All right. All right. That'll go there. That'll go there. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Uh. So what are you doing? Well, you should definitely get Murmansk and uh, Georgia. If they're going for it, they'd have to get it on their second turn. Yeah. Although I don't think he's going to, because he's touching me now. Yeah, he. I don't think he will, but I just want to make sure that he can't. Either way, if he's doing that, then he's dead. Uh, he knows that, I think, or he will know it very shortly. Let's see. Actually, I want to try. That number. I'm deciding how many units I want to use in each. Yeah. Well, they have... At, since he didn't move it the first time, he has absolutely no indication that you are over there. Yep. Mermansk will be the second move. 
Georgia will be the first, so hopefully he will attack into me and lose. Yeah, how many are you in Georgia with? Five. Okay. So the most that I'll have at the end is three. I mean, the least, sorry. The least I'll have is three. <laughs> and that'll probably be what I have, but yeah, I want to make sure. I, I haven't actually checked that analytically. Defender has three armies. What are the chances that four armies will take it? Uh, 41%. Too much. Not happy with that. <laughs> yeah, that's an interesting set of odds because three defending against four has a decent chance of winning, of the attacker winning, but four defending, you need seven. It jumps all the way up to seven. Yeah, that is weird. Five attacking there in Murmansk. Oh, this will be great. If he did that, if they actually started in West Russia and Caucasus, then they're in trouble. History. Yeah. Maybe he, General Arun started here, and then the other guy started in Africa slash South Central America. Hmm. Hmm. That might be it. There, well, of course, there are a lot of places in Africa he could go for too. But yeah, Central it's, America. Looks it's like possible a he may bet. gift to his teammate this turn, or try to blockade something. That Although the, he's not idea. really got a good blockade location. This is supposed to be four. I don't think that matters. But all right, well, I'll go ahead and commit two. Then I guess we're done for now. Six attacking there on my first move. Little ones move around. And then a four attacking Murmansk on my last move. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Looks good. All right. So we will see what happens when the turn advances. Indeed. Okay, turn has advanced. Watching. Let's six, see what six, happened. Two, Victory or defeat. Four in Tajikistan. Yay. He, he moved one more. <gasps> Lol. Hmm. Well, that means he survived. <laughs> Probably. Yeah. yeah <laughs> oh. No, 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 no. Aw, he lost a little more than he did. So sad. Oh, he's well. trying to take Kakasas and he's like, Well, you're already there! No. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I'm already there. Hi. Yeah. Why, hello, Dar. So, you're mm. like mudkips, I hear. Okay, we saw that he deployed four. The other one he probably added to either Eastern or Turkmenistan to get Western Kazakh. Yep. So, he's okay. screwed right now over there. Yep. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to put a few in Hong Kong and then everything else in Pakistan. So, I'm going to be hanging with nine in Tajikistan. Oh, you want to crush him over there? Oh, yeah. All right. Well, I was... Uh... I mean, put enough so you can get Moscow. Let's the, see. Like one in Murmansk, one in Finland. That will guarantee you Moscow. So you think he started in Tomsk too? You really think that? Uh, I would assume. I mean, I don't think he could have taken all four of those territories that quickly. Otherwise, hold on. Because hmm. he had Eastern, Kazakh, Turkmenistan, and Kyrgyzstan after the first turn. Hmm. All right, His you saw him turn move. Was from when Kyr I got. Oh was yeah, when I got yeah. everything. And that was when I saw, and then he moved one from Kyrgyzstan, and he attacked Western Kazakh with both guys from Eastern Kazakh yeah. and Turkmenistan. You're right. To so, uh, to take all three, he would have to have both of them. Yeah. Okay. Well, he's dead. Uh, we will crush his face into the ground. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sounds good. As as if that wasn't uh. Not violent enough. Uh, anyway, uh, moving on. <laughs> yes. Okay, so I'm going to be hanging with nine. How many? Okay, are you... What are you going to... How are you going to organize it? I'm attacking Moscow with four, and I'm hitting him with nine from Georgia. So, yeah. You he, know, you could just put one trouble. in Murmansk, one in Finland, and attack it with twos consecutively. And that, that guarantees it, just yeah, like attack four. Yeah, I guess. I, you can do whatever you want. That's still enough. He can't defend both of us. Does it really guarantee it, though, a two attack? Yeah, a two attacking a one is guaranteed. So you're to guaranteed kill to kill one. one with each attack. Okay, all right. Well, that's true. 
As just a hit with Murmansk first, so that you still yeah. have that extra guy there yeah, to hit true. Archangels. I like that. Happy. All right. Of course, I'll hit it. Doop, doop. Two. Ah, uh, let's see. That, then that, then that. Good. All right. Going. Committing. I right. already did. Good. Watching turn. Okay. Yeah. Put all five trying to defend us. Yeah, Good GG, bro. That. GG. Good luck. But it's not going to work. All right. That's awesome. And I like the way that worked out because I still have... All right, yeah, that's good stuff. All right. Trying to defend against two enemies at once. It'll totally work. And two enemies with bonuses when you don't have bonuses. Indeed, totally works. No matter how good you are at this game, you're going to have difficulty with that. I hope so. <laughs> okay, then... Uh, okay, I'm going to get enough to get both Jingzi and Shanghai this turn. I'm going to put enough over there, and then you put enough to get all Archangels, and then we can just finish him off in Caucasus. Well, maybe I should actually take Ufa, do you think? Or should I not? Well, nah. that, makes them know, that lets them know that you're also going to have that bonus. Yeah, you're right. So just get Archangels, and the next turn you can get the rest of it when, af after you've broken Eastern Kazakh. So this turn, focus on Eastern Kazakh, and then I'll get the other... Th two territories, and then I will let you get all of Kakasas. Should I make that. it my first move this time? No, no, make it a later move. That way he doesn't, like, slip past and get Western Kazakh from you magically or something. Well, I've only got two moves. Huh? I've only got two moves. The attack okay, and Archangels. Fine. How many do you expect him to have? Maybe one. <laughs> Unless he just decides to place a bunch of ones everywhere. Uh, yeah, exactly. I'm going to hit Turkmenistan with four, and then Kyrgyzstan with six. And then after that, so next turn, I'll move into Middle East. Mm -hmm. And then uh, you'll get all of Caucasus, and then I'll move up into Central Russia with my other group. Kill him. Kill him quickly. Yes. Oh, and they're going to get a card next turn. We're going to get a card next turn, too. Uh, actually, he never got a he never got a card that turn. He ah. never got a, he never ah. captured anything. Wow, that so, is that is like That's another way that we're ahead. Insult to injury. I mean, wow. All right. Insult to injury indeed. They we have a get gift a card. card. They won't. Yeah, they do. He may gift it in Tomsk or something. No, well, they could try that, but I think... I, I don't think it would help. No, I'm saying that Purple would probably gift Red another territory oh, elsewhere. Oh, yeah, yeah, the other way. Yeah. To give him a good restart somewhere. Hmm. But it's like in two turns, you're going to have three bonuses. And in next after the next turn, I'm going to get East China. So I'll be getting 12. You'll be getting 17. Yep. And then... Purple might have one bonus, and if he's lucky, we'll be able to get a second one after next turn when I get East China. And Purple, then he's also wait, giving it. Wait, 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 wait. Purple ha already has a bonus. He would have a bonus. Yes. He's getting his second bonus now, I think. Because he's got his first Depending bonus. Depending upon where he started. He's got enough. It would depend upon where he started. That's true. But if I'm assuming the general, you start with two yeah. fours or something like that, two four possible four bonuses. Yeah, that's why I, he either now or next turn he should be getting another one. That mean that means he's gonna have thirteen or so. Okay. Yeah, we'll be able to so handle that. We'll, yeah. Each in each either of us independently could do that. So that'll be fine. So it's like after you get all of Caucasus and West Russia, mm -hmm. you can start working on Europe and Greenland. Got it. And then once you get Europe, you can go into Africa. And also go down through East U.S. Yeah, of course. And then I'll go we'll through. Up eventually. I will go through uh, Oceania to get to Hawaii, and then go meet Central America there. 
Um, I can't really do much through Antarctica. If if you find them in Europe, well, I'll probably go through there just to get to uh, South Africa or something. Yeah, that that Egypt bonus is really. Oh yeah. Oh man, that's. I mean that Egypt. Sorry, sorry. That Egypt uh, wasteland is very. Wow. Yep. Uh, it stops movement there. <laughs> he can't help his partner at all. I'm assuming that he's in Africa. Oh, ooh, South America. Western Siberia Antarctica. one is not going to help him if he tries getting away up there or something. Oh, oh my gosh, he's trapped. <laughs> he's trapped. Well, he would have to go through like West China or something, Mongolia. But Mongolia is a four, so he'd have to attack that with more. He that doesn't have enough than... to attack it with. Yeah, exactly. My gosh. Wow. We may actually be able to kill him. Wow, that is... Well, his teammate should gift him something. Yeah, I know, I know. But uh, we'll be able to kill him over here, and we'll come up way ahead with bonuses. Oh, yeah. And that'll be fine. Yep. Oh, that I didn't know satisfactory. Um, okay, I committed. And oh my God. we'll see what happens next turn. Indeed. Indeed.